This is the <laughs> one. <laughs> What's up, guys? It's Gabriel. No, it's not. <laughs> this is Gabriel. Today, I am with my lovely boyfriend, Gabriel. Hello. We went to Twitter and we read through the hashtag Ask Just Real. Real. And we picked some questions to answer, and that's pretty much it. So we're gonna get right into it. Can you guys imitate each other? Oh gosh. Wait, I actually have to think about what I wanna do. I actually have to think about what I wanna do. All right, I wanna All do. Right, I wanna stop. do. Stop. Stop that. Stop that. Stop. Stop. Let me go. Let me go. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. <laughs> I don't like I this. I don't like this. I'm going oh, to slap I'm going you. to slap so you so. <laughs> sorry, I'm sorry. See, I wanna no. like imitate you, but I would be like, but. I can't force a burp either. You pretend to burp and I'll make the sound okay, funny. Okay, ready? <laughs> <laughs> what is the last selfie you took together? It's the one I posted on the Ferris wheel. Oh, so it's the one that's already on Instagram. Oh, do you want to show the first selfie that we took? Oh, the first selfie we took? So when we started hanging out, I didn't want to Snapchat with him. You were so trying to like, be like respectful of... Yeah. Like making sure that you knew that you weren't trying to use me or anything. Yes. Yeah, so that was like for a while. We didn't take selfies together, <laughs> but my mom kept asking for a selfie of us. Like forever. So one night... <laughs> we were in Urban Outfitters and she took this. Yeah, that was our first selfie. Yep. I kind of wish it was a bit more romantic. Our first photo that we posted anywhere was like really great. Flames. It was like on the oh, high... Oh, I didn't have to say you just flames. Said, oh. <laughs> Can you tell us the story of how you guys met and got into a relationship? Why are we starting oh, to giggle? Oh, because this one is great. Oh. Basically, what happened was she saw me on Jacko's Snapchat. Jacko doesn't actually know that. Jacko doesn't know that. If he's watching this, he's finding this out for the first time. Later on, goes to find my Instagram, follows me, and she like followed me because I like posted Bible verses and stuff like that, and was like, oh, he's a Christian too. So then at that point, she had been planning a trip to America, to LA, and she figured I was from LA because Jacko was in LA, put two and two together. And then she decided to send me a DM. <laughs> oh! So I sent him a DM. And? Actually, I well, sent you were like four. <laughs> <laughs> and I read the DM that she sent me, the only one that she didn't delete. She basically asked like, where I go to church here because she was planning the trip and wanted to visit churches and stuff like that. Keep in mind, the fact that I even found the message yes. was like very like Red. surprising that it happened. Yeah. So I was like, oh, I got a Hillsong out here in LA. And then she was like, oh, I no got a Hillsong way. in Australia. And then we kept talking for a little bit in that message and it kind of kept going. We had like a really, a few conversations actually. Yeah, but it wasn't like flirtatious. No, we were just talking for was, a while. Yeah. So then when she actually ended up coming, we were like, yo, let's hang out. Well, I was kind of more forward about it. I really wanted to hang out with you. And I didn't. Well, it's not that I didn't want to hang out with you. I just didn't think anything of it. I totally did. I was like, this girl is freaking <laughs> also, she's a great Christian girl. <laughs> so then the first time we hung out together, we went to church, but when I went to go pick her up for church, the first thing that happened in person was me knocking on the front door. She opens the door, goes, oh, hold on one second, slams the door back in my face before I can say anything, and I have to sit there right outside the door, like right here, <laughs> waiting for her to come back. I was right. getting the Wi-Fi password priorities. Look at me now. I guess that's eight. like, we hung out a bit and then you went to New Orleans. Yeah, then I went to New Orleans and there was when we really figured out that we were both into each other because we FaceTimed like every day and we're talking a lot. The rest is history. Now we're in love. <laughs> is there anything you would want to change about the day you two met? I would not slam the door in his face. <laughs> True. Your favorite moment together. By the way, I love you guys. I love you too. Well, let's... Be legit. Every moment together is my favorite moment together. So gross. Okay. Someone <laughs> said thumb wrestling challenge. Oh, okay. I'm gonna so, demolish you, letting you know, babe. I do have small hands though. They're barely bigger than yours. So this is even. Thumb wrestling challenge. Oh my gosh. One, two, two three, three, four. four. I, I declare a thumb war. Four, five, six, seven, eight. You're the one I really hate. Get in your corners. Bow. What the fight, fuck? Fight, fight, fight! <laughs> I have a feeling I'm gonna win. No, I'm, babe, I'm gonna kick your butt. Oh, 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 oh. oh I have... 
Babe, you can't do that. <laughs> Cheating one, two, three, what? four, what? five. I win. Did you have your first fight? If yes, what was it about? We haven't. There's been like times where we had the potential to fight, but, but we're both not fighters. It's like kind of like a choice where you choose not to fight, fight, and you just rather like calmly sit down and talk about it and like express your feelings and communicate. Communicate. Communication is key. <laughs> Oh. Next question. Next one. Can you guys sing something for me? Yes. You want yes. Yeah, let's do it. If you follow me, everything is alright. I'll be the one to tuck you in at night. And if you wanna leave, I can guarantee you won't find nobody else like me. Um. Uh. Excuse yourself. Excuse me. <laughs> when you both are not together, separated by distance, do you both still pray together? Love you. Yes. We love you too. We love you too. Yes, we do. We FaceTime. Yes. And we like pray over FaceTime. So it helps keep you like at least like being a Christian couple and like trying to keep God the center of everything. It like helps you stay um, like very close and connected in that way. Since Praying makes us so much closer. Yeah, like one hundred and ten thousand percent. Yes. yes. What is your last social media DM message conversation about? What is it? This is when we gave each other our numbers. Who's it? Oh. Didn't I just send it to you? Yeah. I, that's the first time I've ever done that. We were kind of having a conversation okay. at the fact that I knew the Pledge of Allegiance. Yo, I remember that. You said, have a good night, dude, with peace signs. And I said, you too, and I put like the rock on signs. And then, and then, by the way, BTW, comma, inserts his number. My phone number. I was about to say it out loud and was like, wait, Don't. that'd be bad. Hit me up when you're in town. And I was Night. like, I was like, he just <clears> gave <throat> me his number. And then I gave him my number. And then we sent each other a bunch of emojis. Oh, yeah. What's the most annoying thing about Gabriel, if there is any? Probably the most annoying thing <laughs> is that you're like, you did it in Florida when you bent over, and I thought... <laughs> <laughs> I'm like a really gross person, like, like, farting and burping is like not, like, that's like, if you're in a relationship, like, you have to be comfortable with that. Yes. She like made fun of me, and I looked at her, and I was like, oh look, there's an ant on the floor. And I went like this and bent over right in front of her and farted in her face. She was so, she was like, oh, that's gross. And I still Where's the ant? <laughs> you were like, that is gross. I don't know, I said, there's a penny. I said, look at that penny. And then like after you got over the fact that that was disgusting, you were still looking for the penny. <laughs> okay, this... <laughs> okay. What? This question is for Gab because I don't, can't understand. Did you forget that we were dating before you decided to go out with Jess? <laughs> <laughs> oh, so sad. <laughs> this is the last question. The last question for us. It's okay. What are you doing? What did you guys think of each other when you both first met? By the way, love you guys both. Love you too. Like when we met in person or? Both. Like first impression. Sorry. I know what both of yours were in person and on the internet. Do you want me to go for it? On social media, you saw me on Jacko's Snapchat, sitting over there at that table while he was on the couch here. I was like yelling at him for the- Not he, editing. Yeah, for not editing. I was yelling at him for not editing and I was editing, and I was like, dude, you have to edit, blah, blah, yeah. blah, 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 and you were like, wow, I he's was a like, hard dang, worker. he's a really hard worker. In person was that I looked exactly the same as of my pictures. That's Savage. What I thought, like, after I slammed the door, after I, like, opened it again, and I looked at him, I was like, he looks exactly like he does on Instagram. What about my, my, my first impressions? After you sent me the DM. Yes. I went on your Instagram, and I was like blown away at how talented you were at singing. Minus the fact that I was like, dang, her eyes and her amazing smile. You're being like, so sweet right now. Pierced my soul. And then in person, <laughs> when she slammed the door in my face, <laughs> that was like, oh. I can't even imagine. I know that, that was, was a so pretty. Bad. That was a pretty intense first impression. Thank you guys so much for watching. We hope you enjoyed it. Yes. If you did enjoy it, give it a like yes. down there and leave a comment of like what your favorite part of the video was, like your favorite question or answer. And
And if you want to see more of us, there's we have a few videos of us on my channel. We hope you guys enjoyed it. See you next time. See you next time. Peace out, Cub Scout. <laughs>